What's up, Divas? It's your girl, April. So, it is time for a new Dollar Tree haul. Funny thing, though, I was just there yesterday, and had I knew that they knew stuff came out yesterday after I left, and they stock them on Thursdays, then my ass would have been there today, and not yesterday spending money. Anyway, I only went back to get some of these shelf cabinet things. I got, like, this box that sits on top of my makeup desk, and it holds some of my palettes, okay? Okay. Well, I figured out if I put one, if I put that box of palettes on top of here, I got room underneath. I won't run out of room. I Make me a little space, you know what I'm saying? So I got three more of them. I only need one, but I'm going to put two on my daughter Tati's desk. So I got her one, and I'm going to just surprise her and do my own thing. I did get these two. And I was like, oh, this is so cute. Um, unlike me, I am not about to use these for my dishes because these are actually to put your plates on. Still good concept, but you know what? I need something a little bit more sturdier for my plates. You know what I'm saying? So what I thought these would be great for is all kind of things. So like I was saying about my makeup palettes. Now, I have two boxes full of makeup palettes. And these would fit them perfectly. More organized, what have you. But... Or so, if you have a desk at home, put you your planners or what have you, and you have it very organized. And we're about to hook it up, okay? Dollar store hookup. Now, first of all, I don't need, nor do I need, or need, or need any more makeup. But if you are a girl who loves makeup, then I don't really think that there should be a price threshold. Like, oh, I'm not buying that because that's for the Dollar Tree. No, first of all, I didn't see enough of y'all Dollar Tree hauls where y'all was hauling that new uh, matte lipstick, matte lip gloss from LA Color. So a girl has been searching on the low. When I seen that they had some in there today, like a whole mess of brand new makeup and stuff, the gates had opened up and I was so happy and excited. Like a kid that just was released in a store full of toys or a candy store. I was so happy, even if it was a dollar. So let's start off with a few things I'm going to show you. Well, not a few. I'm not going to show you the food items that I bought because I just don't really find that to be relevant. You guys don't really need to know about my pretzel bites and stuff like that. But I'm going to show you some things that I did get and I thought you guys would love it, love it, love it. So I did see these cute hand sanitizers at the Dollar Tree. And I think these are so cute because if you go elsewhere, you are not... Sometimes you can get both of them, the little case and the hand sanitizer soaked together, but it's not a buck. So I got three of these because Mumsy is always talking about how she loves them and she wants one for her book bag. So I figured, hey, they're a dollar. You have your choice. There's three of them I got and they're different scents. So enjoy yourself, Mumsy. Knock yourself out for a dollar. I also see these, which are like the fake lip balms for eels but they are in fruit version so i got an apple one and a strawberry one there was also a lemon one but i just didn't need that one though what is an extra buck gonna hurt right you know what i mean so i got these these are pretty new these are the lip balms and a mother a mother cannot come home with just lip balms for herself so i've seen these aren't these the cutest they have like these little googly eyes that move and they're so cute sweet pea juicy lips for kids these are cute because the packaging is super cute plus they're great for stocking stuffers as well as that it's their only a buck and i know mumsy is going to love this on to the lip uh to the makeup products on to the makeup products check these out by la colors this is their nail duet polish and glitter set so you get a nail polish and glitter isn't that just so cool i think there were like four different colors to the set i only got two because i wasn't trying to be greedy and be buying a whole bunch of stuff that i really didn't need but yes awesome really pretty now this is a brand that i have never seen or heard of at the dollar tree and it's called diamond so this is their jumbo lip pencils as well as eye pencils so i got this one here which is called the color copper so pretty i think this is really great for um a brow highlight really pretty color and i also got one of my favorite colors which is a nude color this is the nude which is this color right here and a white one 
I love white pencils. They're great because they open and brighten your eyes. So yes. These are the LA Colors Pout Lip Gloss and this is the Super Shine one. There were only four colors to this particular Super Shine. There as well as the matte ones which I'll show you in a minute. And as much as bad as I want to open these up and swatch them, I'm not going to because I'm just going to do a giveaway. The colors that I've seen swatched on YouTube have really been like a great color payoff. So this is the Super Shine one. Now these are the matte lip glosses and these are the ones that I've seen a lot of people with right here. Really pretty colors. I love this color that is more or less right here. This one right here. Very nudish, very pretty, very vampy colors for the fall. So you got yourself like a spring and fall kind of like look going on right here, which is amazing for a dollar. But these I heard are really, really nice. The Wet n Wild Eyeliner Brush for a dollar. Like, come on. If you don't like it, don't feel bad. And if you just starting off with makeup, listen, get your dollar out and buy you a eyeliner. And last but not least are these little tea light candles. They last for 120 hours. They're battery eye operated of course and these are great to put in like little glass dishes just for like the ambiance and stuff like that your girl has a project okay I told you that so yes that was my Dollar Tree haul really simple straight to the point make sure you check them out I would suggest calling and asking them when they put their new stuff out because I know the other one that is a little bit further th from me they put out on Wednesdays, so these people put out on Thursdays. I like if you put out every day. I hope you enjoyed this. Stay Diva and Divalicious. All the information, if anything, is posted for you guys below. If you live in Arizona and want to know what Dollar Tree that I go to, I will post it below. This is the one that has always the acrylic drawers and stuff like that. They have loads of stuff, so I will post that for you guys below, and they are really a great do um, Dollar Tree store. So, yes, on that note, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, y'all, and I'll see y'all on a soon-to-come video.